In less than a minute, I'm going to show you how to clone a private repository on your cloud server. And we're going to do that through the SSH protocol. Let me check if our server already have permissions over our GitHub account. As you can see, we have permission denied, so I'm going to use the keygen to generate the key pair. This command is going to give us two files. One file is going to work as a public key, the other file is going to work as a private key. To give you an analogy to understand what we are essentially doing, we are. this is like going to a market and buying a lock. The lock is going to come with keys. You're going to deploy the lock in the place that you want to secure, and then you're going to use the key to unlock this place. We're going to use the public key as the lock. We're going to put it in the GitHub account, and then our server is going to use the private key to unlock our github account and take the repository that we want to deploy so let me execute the command now we have the files are created i'm gonna read the public file i'm gonna take the path and i'm gonna say cat now you have the content of the public file you're gonna take the content and we're gonna deploy it in the github account so let me copy the file and then we're gonna go to the github account then we're gonna go to the settings and then ssh keys and then i'm gonna create new ssh key and let's call it this let me enter the password okay let's try to test the connection again now as you can see we have success message in here let's try to clone the repository again it's important to understand that you have to use the SSH URL, not the HTTP. HTTP requires different kind of authentication. You'll have to set it up using different method. So I'm going to take the SSH uh, path or link, and I'm going to go back to the server, and I'm going to say get clone. As you can see, we have successfully cloned the repository. Now, if you want to take this step further and you learn how to set up the CI CD pipeline because it uses the authentication we have just uh, set up in here, it will save you much time. I have link for the video in the description.